Hello, this is Crave again, and in this video, I'll show the full installation setup of Windows 11. So keep watching. Now we start. From your laptop plug in the bootable USB. But if you don't have bootable USB, you can download the ISO file and make bootable USB installer, check my link below. Let's check if the Windows read the boot installer. Okay, my bootable installer is ready. So, restart your computer. Then press the boot the shortcut key for boot menu. For all devices, here the shortcut key. Then press multiple times your boot key to show up the boot menu. But in my case my boot menu is escape, I'm using Asus model AMD 12 compute cores. Now, choose your bootable USB to start the Windows 11 installation setup. If you have a product key, use it to activate Windows 11. But if your digital product key linked to your Microsoft account there is no need to enter it, it will be activated automatically if you sign into your Microsoft account. I have digital license linked to my account, so I will set up it later. So, you can choose any version of Windows 11, Home, Professional, Enterprise. But I choose Windows 11 Professional. If you want fresh Windows 11 installation just choose Custom Installation. But if you want your file stay in your computer, choose Upgrade Install Only. I want fresh installation so I choose custom installation. Then format your main drive before you start. Format done, now proceed.
I'm super excited today to announce to you Teams integration directly into Windows. Now, you can connect with one touch, the icon front and center on the taskbar, it's just fast and you're in. You can chat, call, video call with anyone anywhere in the world. And no matter what platform you're using, it doesn't matter. Any device you're using, it doesn't matter. That's so important to understand. Whether you're on Windows or iOS or Android, it doesn't matter. What's amazing is that with one touch around the world, you connect with the people you love. Okay, before we move on from the store, just one more small surprise. Android apps coming to Windows. And I mean coming to Windows. They can be integrated into Start. They'll be integrated in your taskbar. You can window the way Carmen showed you earlier with these apps. And for me, like one of my favorite apps is TikTok, it's true. And they're discoverable through the Microsoft Store using the Amazon App Store. It's really cool. And we use Intel Bridge technology to bring it to life so it's just seamless and smooth. And these integrated apps, I mean, it's just, it, what it does is it brings you into Windows from the most professional editing apps all the way through to the most casual apps you can think of when you lean back on the couch the way Philip had showed you to just let Windows adapt to what you do. We love this. We love that the Microsoft Store continues to be more open, inviting our developers in, inviting more apps into the store, inviting you as our customers to use any app that you love.
How would you like to set up this device? Set up for personal use or set up for work or school. If you have personal account use personal and if you have work school account use work school account but remember if you have digital license link your Microsoft account used it so that your Windows 11 will be activated. I have digital license link to my personal account. So I'm going to use it to activate it my Windows 11. Windows 11 successfully installed on my computer. Now we check if my Windows 11 are activated using digital license link to my Microsoft personal account. Windows 11 Pro is activated using a digital license link to your Microsoft account. If you have more questions feel free to ask. I want to help, especially if you have problems about your activation in Windows 11. If you haven't subscribed yet, Subscribe now and see you in my next video.